glass houses are really important for us here in Dalesford. Uh, it's a short summer um, and long winter we have here. Uh, so uh, these little um, dwellings that we've built all around the place uh, and also various frost protection um, such as uh, above here on the north side where we can grow kiwis and citrus uh, and more citrus down here um, yeah just it's it, citrus will grow well in Dalesford uh, like these lovely Maya lemons but there is a little bit of frost protection above and so this dwarf lemon has just um, struggled for the first two or three years and then it's about five or six years old now and it's really starting to pump. Same with this uh, blood orange. It's really going gangbusters now but the first few years we had frost protection across the top there um, and uh, it's on a north facing wall, an earth, rammed earth wall and that creates a nice heat bank. These uh, citrus are doing okay here as well. We've got more, uh, we've got grapefruit, lime and uh, mandarins over here and another orange. Um, again, there's frost protection above them. So it's, they're not fully enclosed these ones, but they are getting enough frost protection. I've just finished this little cloche. Um, the, uh, the galvanized frame I got from the tip. Um, a local glass guy cut some glass panels for us and the wood came from a friend's mill um, Liam and Mick and Pete's mill they're doing awesome things out there sustainable uh, timber millers and um, all sorts of different artisans are out there and they're also growing food pigs and chickens and orchards and just awesome so yeah these were off cuts that I was able to repurpose um, yeah, so, and then there's glass houses over here as well. Again, there's citrus in there. We really want to build our citrus. This one, this is another blood orange that just went in last year. It's doing really well. It's like a little TARDIS or a outdoor dunny. This one doesn't have a roof on it, so it gets rain, but it's enough of a protection with all the glass in there and it really heats up beautifully. Um, and uh, yeah, creates a nice little microclimate. And this one here, we're, we're stretching a goat skin on at the moment. But this one's growing a jam Japanese mandarin. And uh, Woody's got a little pineapple project going on over there. And there's a, um, we've had some uh, chilies and capsicums. And then this is a little uh, tamarillo that got knocked by the frost. So it's in here as a nursery. Yeah, so basically, um, glass houses, greenhouses, we build them out of whatever we can, old window frames, um, things that uh, we, yeah, we basically uh, salvage and then reconstruct and uh, put together again. So this is uh, gardening in a cold climate, extending the growing season.